Hey everyone, Mike here, Roland Picker. Today's video, I'm going to show you how to run a promoted sale. That is a feature that is on eBay if you have an eBay store. And I'm going to show you how to do it. I use it and it's uh, a pretty good tool. So let's get on over to that video and see what it's all about and how to do it. All right, folks, here we are on eBay and we're going to show you how to do a promoted sale and how to set it up using the uh, promoted feature that you get if you have an eBay store. I repeat, if you have an eBay store. I'll get a little bit into that later. Right now, you go to my eBay and whether you're if you're using the the old keeping it old school like I have it here for this seller ID and not using the seller hub, you're going to see on the left under shortcuts it says manage my store so let's click that and there you go you'll come to my manage my store page and uh, what you're gonna do is you can click here like I do or you can click over to set it up for the first time but I click manage promotion and it brings you to this screen right here you'll see it right here it's all uh, I believe under in the I believe in the um, seller hub it's going to be under the tab that's either under marketing or growth. Uh, when you go there, you'll, you'll find out. It'll say promote listings. And then when you click that, it'll bring you to this page. And from here, you can run your promotions, your markdown manager, and you can do promoted listings. And I'll show you in another video what the promoted listings is all about. And it's something that eBay's moving to, and I think you're going to like that one. But right now, we're doing promotions. So what you do is you will come over here where it says create promotion and you're given several options order discount shipping discount accessory discount sale event and cordless coupon I don't use any of these four I just go for the order discount now you can go ahead and you choose the product line what I do is I skip this step and I go straight into the offers that they have and you can see they've got save uh, 10 bucks it's already showing uh, when you spend fifty dollars or more an extra twenty percent when you spend fifty save ten for every fifty or and you'll be able to change those whichever way you choose them you can do it by quantity you can do a buy one get one which i'm doing the buy one get one free over on one of my other seller ids a bogo and it works pretty good and then you have no minimum purchase sales so what we're going to do is we're going to show them that you can save. we're going to use this one right here extra twenty percent i'm going to say you can save ten percent if you spend $125 or more that's the one I'm gonna go with because I want them to buy more than just one item you know they may not want to buy a bigger item now I will select the item instead of entering the SKUs now what I meant by more item you know maybe they want uh, maybe they 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 want a, a lighter and an ashtray and they say hey you know what I need a new humidor or maybe they just go for a humidor and say, hey, you know, I could use a new ashtray and a new, uh, you know, that's too enticed to get them to buy more, to stay on, on my store pages and shop. And that's what, what it's all about. But right here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click all. And what that does is that can, will mean all these items are available in the promotion. And we'll go ahead and we'll show you how that, how that'll show in the listing. So then you come over here and you click confirm selection and just you know you got them all there then you save and review now the offer name is spend and that um, I believe is just what we're gonna see what they'll see is extra 10% off when you spend 125 can edit that if you want you can add or remove items if you want from here now what I'm going to do is I'm going to run this just till the end of the month and I'll show you how I'm going to show a sense of urgency you click 30 okay then down here you write offer ends Four thirty 
17. It already selects a few pictures for you. Shows it right here now. Offer ends. If you didn't have that there, they wouldn't know and they just think, oh, well, it'll be there forever. Then you launch it. So this is already ready to go. So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and now I do want to show you one thing. You can edit it, pause it, and preview it. So if you wanted to edit, say like um, I added some more items, some more items to more cigar accessories to to my store, then I can come in here, click edit, and then I can get the option. Well, let me just show you. Then we click edit, and then you can go select items, and then you would click add more items, and then any items that are new wouldn't have the approach would be down here at the bottom would not have the blue check mark and then you just add those and then you would go confirm selection the same thing it's not going to hurt here we'll go confirm selection after you've selected save and review now you know april 30th i i want this i don't want it to end at the a.m i'm going to change this i'm going to want it to end by 11 30. i want to give them you know the, a chance so there's a, there's an edit okay now let's go to a list in it and see if it's showing already and it should be so let's go to this alligator all right here you go extra 10 percent off when you spend 125 dollars or more now that'd be on all your listings it'd be just above the image and if you have your store where you're running this other feature that shows all your items it'll show it right here offer ends 4 30 17 discount will be applied when you add promotional items from uber humidors to your cart so they would click eligible items and then it's just going to show everything that you checked okay and i mean it's on it's on all of them now what you do is you'll, you'll want to see the item description and see there it's on all of them so that in short is how you run a promoted listing now I do want to say one thing before I close here me personally I'm not an eBay hater um, you know I'm and I'm not really a promoter my main concern with doing these videos is to help you so that you can succeed and grab a slice of that pie like everybody else there's no reason why other people should be making more and that they hold their secrets close to their to the you know to their vast chest and they don't share them so what I do want to say though and hopefully eBay looks at some of these videos I think this should not be a premium only feature for those that just have a store you know they feel that if you're paying for a store you should have that feature I don't agree with that I think this should be made available for the small seller to the big seller and all that's going to do is when people sell more because they can either run a promotion or they you can set it up for a 10% discount if you buy three or more or whatever. The, the more that the seller is selling, the more the bottom line is for eBay. So I don't know why they wouldn't open this up to everybody. But that's my rant for today. All right. I I'm just would like to see eBay consider making this feature available for everybody. And, and I think that eBay would benefit from it as well as everyone benefiting from it. All right, folks, that's it for today's video on using the promoted uh, sale feature on eBay. If you found this uh, video informative and you enjoyed it, thumbs up. You can always use sharing the love there. And as always, leave your comments down below and your questions in the same spot. And if you don't want to put your questions down there, you can always use the email address, askmike at yahoo.com. Uh, if you find these very informative or interesting, please pass them on to someone who you think might benefit from watching this channel. I really would appreciate it. Um, as always, God bless you all. I pray that he gives you many blessings and great sales and good life and, and good health. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. Mike out.